All right, uh, so me connecting this air handler to uh, it's not a like a cooler or freezer this area uh, they just uh, want to maintain uh, I'm not sure what the temperature they want but it's an insulated box and uh, some kind of food processing so um, it has that area in there should be air conditioned it's actually quite big um, so they had the uh, unit three ton uh, so I just made uh, it's a seven eighths uh, type K copper so I'll put an old trap there and then there's one more up there let me see if I can see from here it's right there Jesus. see there's another old trap I'll put up there so it's, this is a uh, uh, close to 10 feet uh, I think it's 12 that I cut in a bit uh, cut, cut about three, I think it's nine. So, and then, so once everything, uh, all the lines that's braised, then I uh, and uh, pressure tested, then uh, uh, let the nitrogen go, and then I physically add oil from this uh, service port here. I just capped it off because so nothing gets in. So that part is done. Just a liquid line and that's our hole right there. I don't know if you can see. Uh, just the end of the ladder there. You gotta pass the, the condensers up there. Uh, we put the, uh, uh, we had the crane come here yesterday uh, to put the condenser up there. So, yeah, that's, I was just working on it for the last hour or so. That, uh, to put that, uh, that piece of pipe, the oil trap, you know, and that uh, uh, the access port uh, to add the oil, POE. Just need about a quarter of an ounce, not much, you know, just a bit. Uh, you don't put that the compressor will seize in a year, or uh, you put this and you don't add the oil, and then uh, then the first uh, compressor is gonna seize, and after that, because uh, the oil travels with refrigerant but you will seize the first compressor if you don't add oil and uh, but definitely we need two here so and like I said the event's pressure test that we're gonna add POE oil yeah and uh, yeah so uh, plan was to put this up there but uh, but the coil here is literally, a, it's actually an A-coil. It's not a horizontal coil. So, and the height won't fit. And the, uh, this is a supply here. So, we made that return yesterday. And then we put, uh, we supported the uh, uh, two by fours. Uh, so, two by fours here at the edges, you know, we built a box so we can sit the unit. Yeah, you see? That's the stuff they use, see, cocoa. It's a really fine powder. It's like, literally, uh, really uh, gets on uh, your clothes. Uh, you have to wash it. Really fine powder, I guess. Uh, yeah. So all the uh, piping have to be, you can't uh, leave nothing open. Yeah, so we're gonna cut that. I'm just waiting for my apprentice to show up. We're gonna cut that, that would be the return uh, we're planning to put the returns on top but it won't work like I said to, and he doesn't want to uh, get another unit I already told him or at least uh, you know get a horizontal coil and then uh, then we can put this unit on this side uh, we actually uh, that's ours uh, we were gonna pull the unit up there and then put there but then uh, when we looked at the unit there's no way like I said it's an A coil it's like just a like this and you can't put it like this because these are the drain pan like this is built uh, you know you can put it if you have a, a horizontal coil then uh, it will work but uh, this is a A coil unfortunately there's no horizontal coil so uh, yeah, so we, that's what we have to do. Uh, just 
cut that there, connect, that will be our return. And the uh, supply will be up here. I'm gonna cut that and then I have to go and pick up the duck work now. Just uh, uh, run duck work across and then uh, uh, run uh, six inch pipes, six of them, uh, three on this side, three on that side. Uh, and I told them that it would have been, uh, I mean, I don't know why they didn't put doors here. They should have put doors uh, because they, they, they only uh, operate 18 hours a day and six hours. I mean, uh, there's no reason for doors. Uh, I mean, it's going to have lots of heat gain from, there's another one here. Uh, you know, then this ovens, these huge ovens, you know, going to generate lots of heat to there. And also we got the, uh, where is it? Uh, it's, uh, that top one is walk-in freezer. If we didn't put that on, it's some another company put it. Uh, and that's a walk-in cooler on the right-hand side. And another uh, company built this. Like we built these two. I mean, like not built, but we installed them. Uh, yeah, I don't know why they should have put the door. Uh, that's just uh, it's. Uh, it, although it's not a like it's just a air conditioned uh, box basically, um, and uh, so they just uh, running these ACs for now. See one down here. I think there's one on that side. See these guys here. Yeah. So to keep their cool. Oh my God, it's hot in here. Yeah. So yeah, it, uh, you have to go. Uh, when they're uh, preparing uh, food there, we can't go on there, so... Uh, just waiting for my guy to show up and then... These guys have to leave and then we can connect some of the duct work and do... Uh, uh, some of the piping. Just uh, connect that there, you know. They're just sitting up there, so... I'm happy with that, just uh, connect this here to here and then run the liquid line. Yeah, and... Uh, yeah, that's it. So, I'm gonna phone the uh, sheet metal guy, uh, place, I mean, see if the, the ductwork is ready. And uh, gonna put, uh, run this up and then put an elbow and then cut that panel and just uh, go square duct straight. There'll be a, there'll be side 90 up here. Uh, and, uh, yeah. Or was it 11 by I can't remember I the dimensions yeah so yeah it's getting there you know uh, probably uh, finish on uh, work here about four hours a day uh, maybe Monday we might finish yep see uh, here we go so that's the old return you see that's the uh, cocoa really fine powder yeah so that's gonna be uh, the grill for our return yeah too bad we couldn't put the return up there no room you know and with this configuration you can't do it like we we were ready to pull the unit up you see that we pulled uh, that's ours we were gonna pull the unit up there and uh, but it just didn't work you know and he doesn't uh, he didn't wanna get a horizontal coil and uh, I guess because they just moved here uh, they relocated and uh, you know the expenses are high but this and then uh, so there's a dead uh, uh, rooftop unit there uh, next year we're gonna put it next summer he wants uh, uh, like a rooftop unit because this summer is only uh, I guess two months left from uh, July now so till August uh, uh, September maybe they're gonna run that AC in there they won't run the AC uh, in that area in winter uh, yeah and okay so that's what we're doing uh, all right ciao